anchor wireless charging stand. It also has a flat version. I'm gonna show you how to get the most out of it by using a QC3 compatible charger. It's very important that QC3 is used instead of the traditional five volts charger from Apple or any slower non-QC3 compatible chargers. You will see why in just a second. It comes with a four feet long micro USB cable, but it does not come with a charger. So it's important that we pick the correct charger for the job. This is an iPhone 13. You can see from the power meter here, I'm getting 9.2 volts and the amperage is increasing. According to the uh, label in the back, it is capable of doing nine, nine volts at two amps and five volts, two amps. So you will only be able to get the theoretical 10 watts out of this port and you will be probably getting um, 18 watts out of this port if you are an Android user. So iPhone 13, I'm getting a maxed out at 9.2 volts times 1.4. That was 1.4 amps. So nearly 13 watts of output. If I use this port, which is rated at 5.2 volts, 2.4 amps, I believe the maximum is around 10 watts and it's actually slower than that. So it's 5.2 volts times 1.2 or 3 amp, 1.3 amp, 6.76, so less than 7 watts. That is uh, less than 5 or 6 watts less than this port. So keep in mind, you would have to use something like this, which is QC3 compatible. So let's come back here, plug it in. Yeah, instead of telling you how faster, it, how fast it charges uh, compared to other products, the only scientific way is to get the exact number reading here so you can see exactly how fast it is in terms of wattage and this is a five watts traditional apple charger compared to this one now we're getting 12 watts and uh, there's conversion loss this is it's not exactly the watt wattage going into the phone it is more like um, maybe 19 uh, 90 percent efficient all right, now if I use this thing, five watts, you can see from the power meter, it's gonna be around six watts, I suppose. So definitely check out some good QC3 compatible chargers. All right, 7.5, mm, yeah, this is rated at five watts though. Okay, so which means there is about one watt of loss going into the phone. Okay, I hope you find this review helpful. Yeah, the white version works great on my white desk and you can pick different colors to fit the decor or your office setup. Uh, it's a very solid charger. I've been using it for the past two years. Uh, I have multiple of these anchor chargers all around the house. Um, I find them very convenient. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention that it all also works in um, horizontal mode as well as in uh, portrait mode. So it still works. If you want to use it to watch a TV like this, they are positioned at a pretty optimum angle. And if you, if you want to work or text like this is very comfortable to hold and it 
it does not have any MagSafe compa compatibility, so it's not magnetically attached. It does slide around if you are, uh, are, uh, are not careful. You can drop it, but um, so far so good. Also, there's a large uh, rubber pad at the bottom. So the, the stand itself is pretty secure on the desk. All right. Thanks for watching.